look beautiful. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Great How about to see that, you. Lisa Gleason? In our Team chat. Temptations today. I know it, right? Get it. Hey, this <laughs> is Stovetop Temptations. Only the second time ever Tara's brought us a stovetop piece. So this Temptations is able to go on your stovetop. It works on any kind of stove except induction. Correct. That is the only one it doesn't work on. And I will tell you, for the first time ever, in Stovetop Temptations, we're offering floral, floral lace. Floral lace. But you also did a couple of other things that are customer requests. And it begins with a smaller vessel. This one is two and a half. Two quarts. and a half quart. Big customer request, David, which which was a little bit more. Our, the first one we did was a three and a half quart. This is now a two and a half quart. More of that true one dish cooking for maybe just the two of you. And the other customer request, which was brilliant, was for a cook and look, so that you could actually see into what it was that you were lid. making. A clear glass lid, exactly. So we always love your feedback. We're always incorporating it, and we heard loud and clear: floral lace, floral lace, floral lace. So now we have that. let's also tell you this is a tempered glass lid. So these lids. Are oven safe too, right? They're, all, they're, they're also oven safe to 500. So not only is the vessel itself oven safe to 500 right. and put it on a flame, but so is that lid. Wow. Yes. Okay, so are we going to do colors real quickly? Yeah, why here, don't we do that? And then we'll go over and start Perfect. some cooking. Why don't we start with floral lace since that's new? I love right? it. Um, and so, Marion, what I'll do is I'll zigzag across the front if we can. This is green. Come up front. Here it is in light blue. I have it for you in black, in red. In regular blue, eggplant, spice, and chocolate. Yay. All right, now let's do Old World. Here it is in Old World black, Old World green. This is my color, brown. Jump down here to spice. Jump back up top to blue. Here's your cranberry, I think. Yes, you got it. Confetti, red. And finally, eggplant. This is $39.86. Yes, this works on your stovetop. Yes, it works in your oven up to 500 degrees. So everything that we had always hoped we'd be able to do in Temptations has now happened. That's right. But only for the second time ever. Tara has only um, designed one other stovetop piece, which has been wildly popular. So now this is the second in the series. Yes, and here's what I love. First of all, right in front of here, you can actually see we're making soup. So I love the fact that you can put this right on a flame. So now your soups, your stews, all of those comfort foods that we're used to serving in Temptations now can be prepared in Temptations. And you're searing that meat searing in Temptations. Searing that meat. This is what I love. I love the fact that I can go ahead and sear that meat, but then I can also go ahead and add the teriyaki glaze. Let's, let's cool that off a little bit. And then I'm going to add, of course, my broccoli. I'm going to make a little um, orange uh, steak or beef here with a little broccoli, a little carrots. And I'm going to put a little mandarin orange on top of there. Never before, David, other than one other piece, have we been able to do that. I have that great cook and look lid. Put that on. Now when I want to finish baking it off in the oven, all I have to do is bring it right to the oven. So not only does this piece start on the flame, but it then goes into the oven up to 500, into the microwave. Everything you've loved from Temptations, now just better. Now, I'll tell you, at $39.86, it is a phenomenal buy. 400 people on the phone lines and mac and cheese comes out of the <laughs> oven. Your favorite casseroles here. Your favorite stovetop soups are now simmering. If you wanted to you know, use this for your chicken and dumplings that we were just uh, offering, yes. you'll be able to do that as well. So easy, so oh. quick. And Frank, how many of these gone already? 400 are already spoken for. Very as nice. you show. Yes. The virtually non-stick, just like your bakeware, same, same idea exactly. here. Exactly. This is a higher grade stoneware. It's super thick. It's why the pattern's nice and matte that you see there. So whether you're making your soups, whether you're making your mac and cheese, again, it's the fact that you can go ahead and put it right on a flame, only one other piece. Now we're going to go through our colors again, and I will tell you that already over 400 people have dialed in for this. It is brand spanking new tonight. You keep asking me on my Facebook page, <laughs> David, it's a new year. Where are the new items? Where are the new items? Ding, ding. Here is the new item. So so we've got it for you in floral lace green, floral lace light blue. Here it is in uh, black. Is black. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Sure. This is red. Here's your blue. Eggplant. Spice. Oh, last call on spice. Wow. Wow. And chocolate. Last call on chocolate. Fewer than 100 chocolate. Fewer wow. than 100 okay. in the uh, spice. Here is old world black, old world green. This is Old World Brown, my color. Last call in Old World Brown. This is going quickly, you guys. Here it is in spice. I have it in blue. Don't forget cranberry. Here is your confetti. 
most popular in confetti. That's Tara's color. Here it is in red. 100 left in the red. And let's hold on the eggplant for a moment. I want to show you that Tara even took care to make sure that the little knobs on the lids were decorative also. Your old world knobs will have the old world flower. Your floral lace will have the floral lace design. So they're beautifully done. And even the tempered glass lids are oven safe to 500 degrees. 500 degrees. And you know what I love about it, David? And I'm glad you mentioned that about the finials there. Because these are presentation pieces. Yes, they're the workhorses in your kitchen for sure. But they're also going to be great, of course, for when you want to go ahead and put it on the table, which is so awesome. So, yeah, you would let's get going here. Let's get cooking. Let's get some pasta. Remember this colander? Yes. Love that colander. So, again, enamel on steel. So, some of the materials. Materials, things you've been asking for, requesting, wanted to do a little Asian stir fry here. Hear that sizzling, hear that beautiful. What I love about that again is that you can braise things in here, you can um, roast things in here, all the different things that you're gonna love. And we always just say temptations just got better. And if you're wondering about capacity, guys, 75 meatballs, five pounds what? of meatballs in that two and a half quart baker. What Is that not fantastic? Here? It looks like you've got some uh, kind of cobbler going uh, on in there. Of course, I have to do all the traditional things. We did mac and cheese, we made soup, we made meatballs. Of course, we braised our beef. We did a chicken stir fry. We're doing a noodle stir fry and for dessert, how about a little peach cobbler? How about a lot of peach cobbler? <laughs> hey, let's also remind you, wow. as we do this, I'm going to show you colors again. Over 1,000 of these are gone. 600 people on the phone lines. Make sure you grab yours. Now, Frank, let's talk about the most limited before we wrap up, only because I know floral lace chocolate and spice. We're still last call chocolate and spice in floral lace. We're also last call in brown, brown and spice. These two are both last Ooh. call as well in Old World. $39.86. Stay on the line for this. We know many of you may just be tuning in. The second only piece ever Tara's done for stovetop. And this is the first time ever stovetop in floral lace. Yay. Trivia for you, Ooh, my darling. Okay. okay. We are making my zucchini carbonara tonight. Ooh. It's a smart swap, so yeah. we're not using pasta, we're using carbonara. So we're oh, doing zucchini noodles. noodles. Yes. Yeah. Love. So, true or false, zucchini blossoms taste like zucchini. Is that true? So the blossoms of the zucchini plant taste like zucchini. Is that true or false? True. It is true. About.com states that zucchini blossoms taste like the plant namesake and are velvety in texture. The flowers can be eaten raw in a salad or fried and stuffed with cheese. I vote for the fried and <laughs> stuffed with cheese. I do. Yeah. It's too bad Brussels sprouts don't have blossoms. Then you, you know not eat either one. If I could have a bowl full of bacon and put one little lettuce leaf in it, boom, I've got a salad. Perfect. See there? No That's one's what I'm judging. No about. one would judge. No judging. Mm -mm. All right. Am I going to see you Sunday? Absolutely. All right, darling. Mwah. Hey, we have a hot pick coming up, and it's very sharp, and we're going to get right to the point. We've